Today, we will show you how to make a Mura Amasa effect on Adobe After Effects. First is to use the Puppet Pin tool. Pin all the parts that you will move. Select all the pin in the middle portion and slightly move to left from right direction. Copy the first keyframe and paste it to create a looping motion. Unpin the middle portion pins. Now, move the outside portion pins on opposite direction of the middle pins. Adjust your pins if you notice unnatural movements. Repeat this procedure on the other elements on your design. Make sure that the elements you edit are synchronized. Make sure to use Easy Ease on the keyframe that you finalize in animating the elements. Or just simply highlight your keyframes and press F9. Holy look at all this damage!
You can also animate the surrounding elements. Just go to the layer that you want to edit and use Move Tool in opposite direction of the main elements that you edited earlier. And that's it. You're done. The next part is optional but you can also do it if you want to. In this part, we will animate the texts in the design. We animated the red texts by first, oversizing the scale of the text then we returned it to its original scale. This is called, Zoom Out Text Reveal Effect. Next, the white text. This is just simple. Trace your text using the pen tool. After you trace your texts, apply the stroke effect. Lastly, apply light rays effect. That's it. Just adjust your time and keyframes to your liking.
And this is the final result.